Hello, welcome back to Father and Two Plays Mass Effect Andromeda. So we have Pathfinder, stuff to this do. Is Captain Dunn. There's a situation I could use your assistance with. I'd rather not discuss it over open channels. Please come see me on the Hyperion Bridge as soon as you can. Okay, we have lots of stuff to do from what I understand. Hey, Vetra. Hey, Vetra. I wonder heard what my dad would think of all this. Would he have encouraged the move? Come with us if he could? I'm sure he would have. To be with you guys. Yeah, I think so too. Sid doesn't remember anything about him, but I do. I think he might have liked it here. Dark I'll manager. Find a, writer. a word, hey, please. Sure. I stopped an unauthorized shipment to Kadara. Important stuff. Rations, tools, power cells, you name it. Corresponds with inventory discrepancies. Someone stealing and storing supplies around Nexus and Hyperion for delivery to the exiles. If you could keep an eye out for suspicious or out of place packages, I'd appreciate it. <laughs> I got a I'll suspicious package for you. Great. <laughs> Stolen supplies haven't been processed for release, so Sam should be able to detect them. Okay. Hi, I'm Jan Garden, founder huh. of the initiative. Uh, hi, Ignatius. Ah, uh, hi. <laughs> Gil Brody is your engineer, right? That's right. He is, yeah. I'm Bailey. I used to work with him in the hangars here. You wouldn't happen to know if he's available, would you? Depends on what you mean. His duties keep him pretty busy. No, I mean like a... Oh, oh, I know what you mean. Never mind. Just a... Tell him I said hi, huh? You mean like... <laughs> you want to be friends? Okay, let's check our map. Our Miz app. Okay. Got something to do there. Uh, just gonna take a quick look in here. Maybe talk to Jal. How's the cultural study going, Jal? Um. <laughs> Read up on the Elcor Hamlet. <laughs> uh, yes. Ryder? Okay. You I fixed. think performance certainly <laughs> elevated the source material. Did you know that PB's father was an Elcor? No. Oh. I did not know that. I'm trying to remember. How do the Elcor talk? Uh, the Hanar are always saying this one. The Elcor speak very slowly. Amused Elcor. They, they don't... Their emotions are displayed through, uh, like, pheromones and subtle body language that we don't pick up on. So they speak, and their voices are monotone. So they speak what they're feeling. Uh, for example... Sad. I miss my wife. You know, that kind of thing. And there's this joke. Well, I guess it's a real thing happening within the fake universe of Mass Effect where the Elcor are putting on a production of Hamlet. I'd love to see that. It'd be funny. First things first. Tan sent a little gift for your positive message. I'd make the most of it. Today's a tough one. The Exiles. Probably the most live wire topic for our leaders. Yeah. You've I met the treacherous it. mutineers at Kadara Port. Some think the exiles are a menace to be eradicated. Well, there's, they are an enemy, but do. Man. They're a real threat. The exiles threatened the Nexus, and they'd do it again. We should deal with them. I don't want More to More defense them, money for Candros and the others, then. Sorry, I have to cut this short. I need to prep for a meeting. Apparently some colonists want to talk about the series. Maybe they'll be willing to go on camera. Hmm, I didn't like... But I mean, they are a threat. I can't lie. They are a threat. They're thinking about stealing and killing us here so that they can take what we have. Maybe not all of them, but it's on their agenda. It's on the docket. What's this? Search the commons area. These are stolen supplies. Transferred goods. I'll alert the, the Ingara are survivors, and they're willing to help. 
They'll be great allies. Uh, who the hell are you talking to, Ryder? Okay. Vigilant armor. Oh, that's pretty cool looking armor. Hold on. Go back there. Rotate. That's pretty badass looking. What's its, uh... What's its stats, though? Uh, just trying to remember. Scroll text, no. Rotate item, no. Select item. Huh. I like that stuff. It looks cool, but I don't know... If... Oh, there we go. Damage resistance and weapon accuracy. And what about the chess piece? Weapon accuracy, power, restoration, and defense. Okay. That's not bad, but... Um, what's the spear point armor? That's kind of cool, too, but not nearly as cool as that. Yeah, what what's the helmet look like? Yeah, so it looks a lot like N7, this uh, initiative... Um, or, sorry, Pathfinder, Vigilant Armor. But we don't need it. And that's all the armor they have, so let's check the next terminal. Crusader, Falcon, Katana, Omniblade, Viper. No, we're good. And... Ooh. Any color can claim to be the new black, but nothing quite stands up to the original. Yeah, we'll buy that. Be the first to explore a new galaxy while sporting the official colors of the Andromeda Initiative. Verdant Hunter. The dark green tones are evocative of Ket architecture. Yeah, we'll take that stuff because why not? Oh, hello, Pathfinder. Oh, hello. Gotta take that. Gotta take that. Take, uh, take both of those. That. Yes, yes. Yes, yes, just, uh, I need them all. Give them all to me. I wish you could equip armor and stuff on your allies. I probably don't need all of them, but I'm taking all of them. Yeah, 14 grand, I mean, we could afford that and still have, like, 20 grand. We're good. Okay, oh, uh... Yeah, I guess we're done here. Oh, actually, do we have something new for the bar? Let's go check. We probably don't, but I might as well check while I'm right here. music sounds like you're in a Mario dance Arthur, club or right something. Up. I need to know something from you. Shoot. You've been to Gadara. You've wow. seen the exiles there. It's the shadow man. with us. Friends, family, co-workers. A lot of us worry about them. We hear it's chaos. That it's doggy dog. It's hard living. They have to watch their backs and do whatever it takes to survive. So scary. Despite what happened, my heart goes out to them. Thank you for taking the time. It's a good attitude. We should still care about them. They're humans. This place is getting busy. Looking good there. Let's hear it. What do you got to say, Liam? Liam? Buddy? Take a break, Pathfinder. Everyone needs it. Is that all you have to say? Take a break, Pathfinder. Everyone needs it. There you are. Looking for the meaning of life? At the bottom of a bottle? You didn't leave a note. We were worried. Well, as you see, I'm fine. Uh-huh. What? I can't kick back? Have fun? Man, no offense. It's just... Just what? You don't seem like you're having fun. <sighs> I grew up on Omega. You'd think I'd know how to drink. What's this really about? PB thinks I don't care about the crew. That you're all just experiments to me. Do you... Is that how you think I see you? 
Since when do you care what PB thinks? It's not the first time someone told me that. In fact, every one of my exes said something similar. Hence why I'm taking a break from relationships. <sighs> you didn't answer my question. Is that how you think I see you? You wouldn't be moping in this bar if you only saw me as an experiment. I don't mope, but you're right. <laughs> <sighs> Thank you, Ryder. I should get back. What about your wine? I'll save it for another day. Saving wine? Is that a thing women can do? You again. You again. Looking good there. You're looking good there. I actually, I dig this song. Still makes me think of like what Mario would be listening to in the dance club. Him and Luigi up with Peach and... I can't think of any of the other women's names in Mario. Okay, so, Cryo Bay Habitation Deck. Uh, before we go there, let's go to Operations. Is it water on the knee? Operations! A whole bucket, see? Sorry, it's the ads from when I was a child. They're stuck in my brain, like, I don't know. As sleepers wake from stasis, the initiative urgently requires blood tissue, and DNA donations. Um, medic, if you think you may be eligible. How much tissue do they want? I'm sorry, Lana. They're just trying to boost our morale. Anything going on in here? Can't nope. do this. Sure they can. Especially tonight we can ask. Oh. A ray of hope. Concerned citizen, what do you have Pathfinder? to say? What is it? You're out there, facing the cat. We hear only rumors making them out to be monsters. Maybe they just don't understand us. Do you think peace could ever be possible? Anything's possible, but I do doubt it. The cat seems set in their ways. So it would be up to us to change? If they have their way, they'll change us into them. That's what they do. Oh, I see. We must continue the fight then. Thank you for your time. Fallout from the recent uprise. Hmm. Oh look, it's a space secretary. Firearm proficiency is up. Uh, let's talk to Kandros real Apex quick. So that's what the kid are up to. Transforming people into willing slaves. Now we know why they take so many prisoners. Well, they're sure as hell not taken anymore. Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. No, I meant I meant I have to poo. Can I talk okay. to you, Ryder? Sure. Any logistics update? What's up, Sid? Good that you're here, Ryder. I found something while monitoring comms for the Nexus. Multiple attacks by people called the Three Sabers. They're hitting outposts and supply vessels. The really weird part is they seem aware of our operations, like they're getting intel. Remember the last time you asked for help? Yeah. I swear on Vetra's favorite gun, I'm not lying or getting you to clean up my mess this time. I put in an official report. They keep saying they'll investigate, then they don't. But you're the Pathfinder. If someone's betraying the Nexus, you have to do something about it. If they seem to know our operations, that could spell trouble. Best to get to the bottom of it. Thank you. I knew I could count on you. Best I swear on my powder ever. blue jacket. I don't know where they hide, but I got the I math will find for the three Saber. Saber. Maybe the Tempest scanners can figure out where they went. The Tres Sabres. It's impossible to get a signal on this. Okay, let's check around still. Might be more to talk about. We'll end, not end the episode necessarily, but, you know, end our exploration of this area with, uh... Hello again. What's her name there? Oh, what's up, Sellers? Excuse me, Pathfinder. I don't know where else to turn. My best friend's been missing since the revolts. Tell me. 
He was involved with a woman who was exiled. She obsessed over him, and I'm sure she kidnapped him. The powers that be don't buy it and don't care. <laughs> they say most likely he went willingly. Love can make us do strange things. He didn't love her, she was just a fling. The initiative has branded him a traitor. I don't want that to be his legacy. I want to clear his name, Sanjeev Clement. The woman was Delaney Roos. She must have taken him to Kadara. I'll see what I can do. I'm in your debt. <laughs> okay. Hi, Ryder. Cora? Anything to say? Ah, Hi, Ryder. Nothing to say, okay. What about you? The Angara have nothing to fear from the people of... I see you've crossed paths with Sloane Kelly and the Exiles. A thorn in our side, if ever there was one. I don't think anyone came all the way to Andromeda to live like that. The Nexus was part of this, too. It's about the future, Ryder. What sort of civilization will we form in Helios? One driven to extremes of anarchy, or one dedicated to order and justice? I choose the latter. Sloane Kelly and her mutineers chose otherwise. Yeah, well, Did you have some other business? Have to say. I'm curious. What do you know about the people who backed the initiative? What everyone knows. Gian Carson was the founder and visionary. Unfortunately, she died on the Nexus during the Scourge disaster. Is there anyone else? I would almost welcome them. A voice to silence the rabble. Then Cash might listen. But no, we're alone. Why do you ask? I have information that suggests Garson wasn't the only one. What sort of information? I'm telling you. It's, it's the elusive man. But there was a silent partner. A benefactor. Even if that were true, we've been here 14 months with no sign of them. This partner is either a phantom, missing, or dead. Nope. Gian Garson was the beacon. A sad end to someone of such stature. Dying alone. Oh? It was chaos. By the time they found her, she was already dead. Succumbed to her injuries. Was there a follow-up investigation? I wasn't even out of stasis. But knowing the violence of the Scourge disaster, death was everywhere. If you're suggesting something else happened, Ryder, I'd rather you didn't. Let's not add to the confusion. Yeah. Thank you for your time. You sure you didn't have something to do with it there? Ryder, if you wish to pursue this further, Hi. accessing Nexus security records may reveal more information. Okay, how do we do that? But I, I definitely do want to do that. Uh, let's check our map here. this okay we'll do that for sure but first we're gonna talk to uh cash is that her name over here oh no it's not even cash it's uh wilma wilma what's going on why are you whispering i'm planning a surprise for superintendent cash she's always complaining that our stock of spirits is tame i hear kadara port is famous for bizarre homebrews supposedly pack a powerful punch Hoping you can pick some up, and keep it quiet. You do know Krogan of super hearing, right? What? Shit. Oops. Hope you can find something. Mom's the word. <laughs> okay. You guys got I'm anything to say? I'm worried about this place if the cat find you. Send me to back to the station. It's all we can do here. You just keep the Pathfinder safe and the cat busy. And be careful out there. I only have one of you. Aww. Hey, Ryder. Hey, Drac. Pathfinder. Well, I'm done for now. Nothing more for now. Good luck out there. Okay. Well, let's go check these records then. Uh, 
Garson Investigation Closed File Number 1A98 Addendum Update to the missing persons report filed on Gien Garson. Maintenance crew found her body in the Nexus apartment. Severe burns were apparent, similar to others who saw we saw who were killed during Scourge disaster. It's unclear how she got there, but confusion and disorientation during the Scourge events are likely. Events align with the timeline. Cause of death? Casualty of Scourge disaster. Case closed. Any of... Hmm. The only hard fact is that her body was found in one of the apartments. Then connecting her death to the Scourge disaster was mere speculation. Yeah. They just wanted this to go away. I think we need to check out that apartment. Environmental data will allow us to reconstruct the scene. Missing Persons Report, J. Garson, file number 1A98. Andromeda Initiative's founder, Jeanne Garson, has been reported missing. She was last seen during the emergency stasis revival that occurred after the Scourge encounter. A bulletin has been issued. So she was reported missing first. Let's keep investigating this before we head to uh, the Ark. So, to the docking bay. A ray of hope for sleep-starved residents. Maintenance begins on malfunctioning sunlamps, causing unending daylight in some Nexus quarters. This is HNS. Okay. So. The apartments. There they are. Oh, investigate the Nexus apartments, but this isn't. Hold on. I'm being thrown off by this. Is this an apartment? Over here? No. Okay. It's just a confusing marker. So it's up here and over where PB's apartment is, correct? Indeed. This one? This one. This is where Jean Garson's body was discovered. What are we looking for? If you scan the room, environmental data may allow for scene recreation. Give a quick save here. That's a little weird. Extrapolating data from environment environmental sensors. Precision threshold 82 This was no accident. She was murdered. As this incident occurred over a year ago, her killer is likely far away by now. Yeah. But, wait. This whole area was shuttered back then. Didn't open until the Hyperion arrived. So what was Garson even doing here? Perhaps a further scan of the room is in order. Um, an affair. I don't know. <laughs> There's a hidden door in a the wall. A hidden door. What okay. do we have here? What do we have here? Got to scratch my ear. My earballs. Um. All right, couple of data pads. Start with the one on the right. Garson notes, entry 1.1 at 2819. In 2179, once mentioned, a storm is coming, said evidence was clear, meaning? Andromeda, why? Hyperion, still no contact. Where's Alec? Did they get him too? This is Gian Garson. I don't have much time. I've been hiding in the sealed off sections of the Nexus since we got here. Someone's trying to kill me. And now I can hear them down in the hydroponics area. They're coming. I've embedded what I know in my VI in the cultural center. This log has the code. And whatever happens... Oh god, they're outside the door. Wow, this is some serious shit. I was literally yes, thinking the same traveling. thing. I have the code she mentioned for the VI kiosk. <laughs> I was literally thinking that exact thing. Like, this is some heavy shit. What happened? Like, I kind of thought maybe she was murdered. It seemed a little convenient that she just died. 
you think she'd be the most well-protected person if she didn't die in like cryopods getting sucked off of the, Welcome to the cultural nexus or something, then Please have a look around. Be- seems there, weird. I'm Jean Garson, the founder of the Andromeda Initiative. I thought you might like to hear more about our plans. We hope you'll enjoy learning Sam, can we hear that message Garson talked about? Unlocking it now. Rerouting to our private channel. For years, there was a silent partner involved with the initiative. The truth is, I was running out of money. Then a benefactor stepped in. I didn't ask questions. I never met them face to face. That was a mistake. I lied to everyone. Something big spooked them in the Milky Way, and now they're moving a hundred thousand of us to Andromeda. I hope it's all for the good, but I have my doubts. And now I think they're going to remove me. Alec Ryder and I had a code word for this. Fulcrum. He may have learned more. What did that mean? Something big in the Milky Way. Perhaps your father's locked memories hold the answer. He might have known more. Yeah. Guess I'll have to keep unlocking them to find out for sure. Uh, just gonna check in on the scientists here while we're in the area. Oh, hey. But the plants have adapted to the Scourge's presence. My model of Helios blossoms with data thanks to you. Here, please. You have earned this. Here, okay. a yes or no would suffice. Hmm? Oh, yes. Properly steamed or roasted. Um, so let's add more combat skills. We're gonna upgrade Nova to the last level. We'll make it more powerful. And, wow, like, I knew something was going on. I'm telling you, it's the elusive man. Uh, the Cerberus is is the benefactor. Because they're dealing in AIs, and the elusive man was all about AI. So, Cryobay. What's there on offer? Let's head back to operations, just to see. It looks like there's something to do here. Authorities continue work to establish contact with our Milky Way descendants. As of now, beacons confirming arrival in Helios remain unanswered. This is HNS. Do you think all knowledge of us even leaving, like, if human beings did survive what happened over in uh, the Milky Way, do they even remember that we left for Andromeda, or is that like a secret, or uh, not a secret, but a thing lost? Updates are due within the hour. to uh, history, and, and nobody knows that we left because everything was destroyed. Okay, let's go Cryo Bay first. As sleepers wake from stasis, the initiative urgently requires blood, tissue, and DNA donations. See a medic if you think you may be eligible. When they say DNA this donations, are they talking ADS. about? You know, baby batter? Hmm? Maybe? I doubt it. <laughs> but who knows? Artificial insemination might be happening all the time. I prefer um, non artificial insemination myself. But... Well, <laughs> that came out wrong. I like to inseminate with my penis, supplies. not be inseminated. <laughs> It's really not a good way to ask to get laid. Like, do you mind if I inseminate you? Most people will probably say no to that. Shows your name as Brenda. I don't know why I'm going down here. I do it, like, all the time. I just feel like one day there's going to be something right down at the end, a quest or something. Okay, so we found the other uh, supplies. Hello, dude. Mm, we could talk to this doctor real quick, but I don't think it has a point. Back for a visit? Yeah, no. That's all, Harry. Thanks. That's my timer, but we're gonna finish up with stuff on the Nexus here before we end the episode, and then we'll be able to head out next time, figure out where we want to go, what we want to do. So, to the habitation deck. Have a few answers as 
the dark energy anomaly known as the Scourge limits travel and communication in the cluster. This is HNS. Another cache of stolen supplies, alerting the dock manager. Okay. I know the captain wanted to speak to us. That's okay, Drac. I'll just hang out here. Thanks, though. Guess you're busy, huh? Nah, just caught up in my own thoughts. Got a lot of them. But I'll see you on the Tempest, huh? Sure thing, kid. Hey, Ryder. Taking a stroll? Not really. What Something are you like doing? That. I just wandered over from the Nexus myself. That place bores me. It's not the same. There's hope now. Hope is good. I spent over a year stuck there. Well, when I wasn't exploring Eos. And I know things are getting better. More lively. But there are too many bad associations. I probably won't hang out there much. Hmm, okay. Fine with me. Um, let's talk to Lonnie. Pathfinder? Yeah, nothing. Have to go now. And the captain's up there, but we'll go do that last. First we'll go... Check out the SAM node. Don't think there's any changes, but might as well check. Welcome back, Ryder. Nothing. Of and check our dad's room. Archive system. Your father's personal locks. Nothing new. When studying an extinct race. Right, that's Liara. Okay. So let's talk to the captain. Mon Capitan. Wait, what's going on here? Oh, it's done? She's just over there instead of standing here. Okay, fair enough. What's up, Dunn? Sorry to call you in. Dun, dun, but this dun. is best handled discreetly. Okay. Talk to me. Short version. One of Harry's med techs snuck a relative on board. Woke them up, cut them loose. Turns out, this relative has a rare illness. Not contagious yet, but in the later stages. They exposed the whole station to a potentially contagious illness? Yes. We need to keep this quiet and handle it fast. This gets out, we'll have a station-wide panic. Said. Besides, this is a Hyperion matter. My responsibility. That makes it mine too, doesn't it, Captain? Thank you, Ryder. Please keep this to yourself for now. The only way this ends without major losses is if we handle things before the rumors get out. Right. I'll look into it. Good. Talk to Harry. He can brief you on the details. Let's bring this under control before it's too late. Harry in the cryo bay. Okay, um, I guess we'll end the episode before we speak with Harry. Uh, we'll head over to the shuttle and then... Yeah, we'll end the episode there. So, until next time, if you enjoyed it, please leave me a like. Subscribe if you want to see more, and leave me a comment. Let me know what you thought. This is Ryder, signing off. Mm -hmm.